I was in a situation where I didn't really know. I was being told anywhere from maybe the second to sixth round, and we never really knew exactly where I'd land. So it was just kind of coming down to the day till, till we found out. I drove home the night before um, the draft from college. We still had finals going on. So I remember driving home, not getting a lot of sleep that night. That afternoon, we, we just watched the draft on the internet. We followed my parents and I. We were kind of pacing through the house. Uh, we listened from the first pick until my pick. I think I was 92nd. You know, you start hearing some names that you're familiar with, and you're just hoping that um, one of those is going to be you. We could kind of listen through the internet as well as watch it pop up. And we, we thought we heard my name, and I remember my mom screaming and yelling and we kind of had to go back and rewind it and make sure that they did say my name and then uh, shortly thereafter we got a phone call um, from the Phillies and uh, got the confirmation. It was a dream come true, there's no other way I think to, to describe it. I mean it was, it, there was a lot of relief, a lot of excitement, a lot of anxiety with it. From that point it was just like excitement and just anxious to kind of get started. I think we just embraced. I think we, we embraced, we hugged, and we just kind of had a special moment. I mean, my parents have been such a huge part of my baseball career and athletic career, and you know, their support has been incredible over the years, so it was really just a, a dream come true for me, and I think it was for them too.